Shina Hurley from Love is Blind and Alyssa Elman from Married at First Sight are reality stars with a lot in common, as both women got cold feet while they were participating in dating experiments. However, Alyssa has more of a reputation for being a villain. The MAFS cast, producers, and fans have grown impatient with her. Now, it looks like Shina may be following in her footsteps. When it came to her reality relationship, each woman took one step forward and two steps back. Alyssa matched with Chris Collette, and her hesitance was notable right out of the gate. After Chris' friends revealed that he could be condescending at times, Alyssa found the fuel she needed to stoke the simmering coals of her discontent. The former MAF stars predicted that Alyssa would reject Chris, and they were right. Meanwhile, Shina had two connections in the Love is Blind pods. However, her relationship with Shane Jansen was more physical than emotional, and he opted to propose to Natalie Lee instead of her. The fact that Shina had another connection might be part of the reason why she was hesitant with Kyle. Love is Blind viewers were naturally cringing when Kyle Abrams proposed to Shina. What made things worse is that Shina and Alyssa are both terrible communicators. While they felt they were putting everything on the table, they consistently held certain things back from their potential partners. With Alyssa, fans, the cast, and MAFs, the after-party host Kesha Knight Pulliam suspected Alyssa was just not attracted to Chris. However, in an effort to possibly not seem superficial, she used every other excuse in the book. Similarly, Shina reacted oddly when she first saw Kyle. She claimed her hesitance to go all in with him was because of their religious differences. However, Shina was aware that Kyle was an atheist when she accepted his proposal. Both women decided almost immediately that they needed boundaries and refused to sleep in the same room as their partners after meeting them. Shina from MAFS even left the Mexico honeymoon early when she wasn't feeling Kyle. On the other hand, Alyssa stuck it out in Puerto Rico, but clearly for the vacation and not for Chris. The entire MAFS cast called her out for wanting to be there to be on television and enjoy the show's perks. Nonetheless, Kyle was disappointed by Shina's Irish goodbye. He said, I need better communication from Shina. Horrible communicator. I mean, how do I even know you are alive? I'm a little worried. Kyle did stay optimistic that he could grow on Shina if he stayed flexible. However, what he didn't know is that Shane was still in the back of his mind. At this point, MAFS fans think Alyssa is a bad person and Shina could still win over love as blind fans. What makes Shina and Alyssa most eerily similar is the sense that they can't be completely honest. Also, they wanted to throw in the towel when they didn't get the picture-perfect partner. They also seem to be lying about how much looks played into their decision to reject their partners. Married at first sight and love is blind are wild social experiments, so while it's understandable that Alyssa and Shina had issues, they may grow after their experiences. I'm the strip to I'm the that I'm the that I'm the that I'm the that